Silly boys, silly games, silly boys, silly games. Hello, Eddie. Hi, Eddie. Oh, well, we might not be here for too long today. We're working with a new setup here at uh, Silly Boys, Silly Games Studios. Boy, that sounds official, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It sounds like but, like we got an actual uh, studio. Yeah, right? <laughs> Certainly not just my bedroom. <laughs> Set well, up with some recording well, equipment. <laughs> there is a uh, oh, one little tiny difference here. You got a projector. I got a projector, and it's big. The we're screen no is longer, big now. <laughs> yeah, we're no longer playing on a big screen TV. Yes, we are playing on a projector, projecting on a screen on the wall. Uh, it does ne necessitate a few things, like um, we need to wear headphones now to. Uh... <laughs> To, to not be drowned out by the sound of the projector. <laughs> yeah, the projector is very loud. Yeah. yeah, and it's actually on the on the quieter side of things. <laughs> Quite a big loud projector. Yeah, it, it needs it. It produces a lot of heat, which is weird. I mean, unless it's using an incandescent bulb, like, is it producing? Uh, maybe it is using an incandescent bulb. It's, I hope not. It's, it's bright not. enough. <laughs> oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Well, in any case, uh, like I was saying, this might be a little bit of a short session. Uh, I I'm explaining this to you, Eddie. Uh, it might be a little bit of a sh short session, yeah, just yeah, because we want to be sure that everything's working. And, and when he says, in his bedroom, he's just talking metaphorically. You understand that, Eddie, right? Yeah, you get that, right, Eddie? I think he's nodding. <laughs> it looks like nodding, kind of. Yeah, yeah, I think he's nodding. I mean, if I had to nod, but I, I didn't have a neck, that's how I'd do it. Yeah, that makes sense. Makes sense to me. Oh, we're also using um, different microphones. It's actually the microphones we originally used, and then I realized that it's a lot more convenient just to have uh, the little mics that you have on the on the headsets. Yeah, it, it's this whole ordeal of bringing headphones over. Uh, I, I mean, microphones. Bringing microphones over and setting things up and getting all the balances right and everything, but versus you know, plugging in some headset. Yeah. Uh, but of course, right now, I mean, we're in Silly Boys, Silly Game Studios. Yeah. So, uh, so yeah, official. more permanent of, you know, setting things is what's going on here. Oh, yes. Uh, it's starting to get dark out. Ooh, ooh, I had, I had a good idea now that I remember it. Um, what was your good idea? Oh, lordy. Uh, and they are, okay, just the Legion Raid Camp. Okay, so... We got these slaves that we are supposed to free for this quest, right? Uh -huh. Right, but I don't want to piss off the Legion. Right? right? So, who do I know that also hates the Legion and might get rid of them for us? Well, clearly it's Eddie. It could be Eddie, although I did the whole... Um, Secret code word, tell him a joke, Eddie, and he didn't just open fire like we practiced. <laughs> so, so it, you need to go lead the NCR. Um, lead oh, the NCR? Oh no, my friend. I don't think you remembered a certain <laughs> thing that I've got. <laughs> oh, right. You have the radio yes, thing. Yes, I do. All right. Uh, breaker, breaker, oh my god, they're everywhere! Send everyone! We need absolutely everyone! Send in the rangers! Send in the, send in the rogues! Send in the wizards! Send in the clerics! Send in everyone! <laughs> You're such danger! Come soon! Come fast! Challenge rating 20! <laughs> we got a Tarasque! CR 30! Oh, 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 here we go! Get him, ranger! Yeah, it's just, it's just a ranger wandering into a legion camp. Oh. You know, as they do. That's one down. Okay, yep. come on, ranger. No, 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 don't get surrounded. Oh, I'm detected. Why, why, why they're hiding? Oh, no, this is just random acts of violence. I have no stake in this fight. Oh, how did this, this happen? Is, this is oh, the human. Oh, there's yeah. another one down. Oh, the humanity. Those rangers got down. It's yeah, I'm, good I'm, combat I'm actually skills. kind of impressed. Uh, let's see. Uh, those are just the mole rats off in the distance, those red ticks, right? I didn't piss off a bunch of Legion? I think why so. Not? Why not? Well, wh why would you have pissed off the Legion? Mm -hmm. You didn't do anything. That's right. Okay, I think 
we might have cleared out this can. No, we didn't. The rangers did. That's we right. Just, the rangers just happened, happened to stumble. Oh, across. now you're here. Good job. Good job. Um, incidentally, do you want to make out? <laughs> Duh. Sorry. Um, really strong women are a turn on. Because uh, uh, I'm also a really strong oh, woman. Uh, as I remember. Yep, yep, yep. Look at me. I'm so strong and sexy. Check out this hockey mask. Oh, yes. Oh, baby. Oh, yes. Okay. I think that worked pretty well. Now, let's see. Again, this is something that the NCR should have been able to do by themselves. But they're just like, oh, no. We don't have the resources to launch raids on Legion camps. Uh, Denarius? I was hoping for, like, a Legion ear or whatever it is you're supposed to get from them. But oh well. Can you can you take the armor and sneak into camp and pretend you're one of them? Yes. Um, not everyone will be fooled by the disguise, but that is a tactic you can do. But they're mm. cool with me, so I don't need to. I don't think it would be something where I could release the captives. Ooh, ten millimeter submachine. That should sell for a lot. Yeah, we're fine. Throwing spears might be fun at some point. That's a claw omelet. That's... No, we didn't need mute fruit for that. I thought we? it was. I thought it was. It might have been crunchy mute fruit. Oh, you might be right. Oh, well. Healing powder. I you know. Oh, shoddy! What are you doing here? That's not shoddy. It's an idol. Ah. They are worshippers of That's shoddy. Right. It's a... Uh... Shoddy must be one of a member of their um, their pantheon. Ooh, yes. yes. Yeah, we don't really talk about the religion with the uh, with the legion. A lot of healing powder. You didn't need to talk about it with the legion. They already That's knew. True. They were very quick to accept. Okay, I'm starting to lean towards the legion side here. Maybe we shouldn't have uh, so readily done so many nice things for the NCR. Okay, now that this thing is raided, you are following me around, aren't you? You are the best. Yes. I like you. All right. How long is she going to continue I doing have that? I have no for? idea. It's possible she's programmed to like just help me with one battle, but said she just fought them on the way here, and then was uh, so like Ranger reporting for duty. Okay, now let's see. That's possible. Yeah. Okay, I can't actually. Hang on. Okay, so I can, while quote unquote hidden. Uh, let's try untying it. Will I lose Legion? Nope. And you. Untie it. Merciful Thug! Okay! Oh, hey, oh. the Powder Gangers like me! Awesome! By your reputation as a thug, you are now known to occasionally show a charitable side. I mean, I completely wiped out the Legion. Yeah, or the, the, the NCR. Yeah, I don't think they have anything to go back to. <laughs> All right. Oh, well. Oh, well. On the plus side, the ranger didn't immediately kill the powder gangers because they're supposed to be hostile immediately. <laughs> so, all right, then. Well, we completed another quest, and the Legion, as far as the Legion are concerned, I'm blameless in this whole thing. The yeah, wandering ranger. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Hey. Hey, hey, ranger. Over here. Yeah, look, look. Oh, no. Oh, okay, dude, seriously. What kind of gun does she have? Um... One she's very good with. Uh, yeah, with the Brock flower makes the healing powder. I thought you guys would be dropping like the little bounty things. Looks like you have a caravan shotgun. I'm not sure if my caravan shotgun is fully um, repaired up yet, so I might take it. Uh, it's better legionary. It takes a bit more to go down. Yeah. Awesome. You like that? But Ranger still wins. Yeah, she does. After all those other fights, even. What, health is, what health is she at? By this um, point? she looked like she was at about half health. You know, I'm gonna try some throwing spears, cause they seem like fun. Ranger at the ready. Yeah, you are, aren't you? Um, looks like she has a caravan shotgun, or maybe that's a lever action. Um, cowboy repeater. I think that's a cowboy yeah, it looks repeater. Like, it looks like lever yeah. action. I mean, I don't know if the caravan shotgun's a lever action or not, but. Uh, probably not. Their break action. That's just for, um, reloading. Okay, let's see. 
Maintain, yeah. There we go. Um. Hmm. No, it might be a caravan shotgun. I think she has a cowboy repeater, which is a decent gun, I, I recall. All right. I think you found a cowboy repeater on one of the, your Legion guys. That's true, but this one's already in maintenance Bones. and yeah. practically yeah. full. So you didn't take it. Yeah, you're right. So. Oh, well. Let's see. Well, that was a good experiment, and now we just have... Talk to her. Talk to her. See what she has she to say. She says this. Ranger at the ready. That, that's yep. it. No dialogue options. Okay, we're going to have to give her a name. Uh, oh, ooh, she's angry. Oh, is there another legionnaire coming in? Yes, there is. Because, of course, they come back like to camp. That. So you can just hang out here and eventually wipe out the entire yeah, legion. I hope none of them are, like, names. Oh, just to uh, recruit the counts. And you have a 357. Not great. Anti-venom will take, though. We are the scorpion I'll puncher. Okay. Well, I'm going to find... Oh, there were some red ticks to the southwest. Which admittedly... Mole rats. Yep, rats. which admittedly could mean... That they're like miles in that direction, thanks to Eddie's bonus power. But let's go throwing spear and let's check this out. I imagine I'm pretty good with these things because how could I not be? Yeah, obviously. Oh, you were right. Mole rats. Yep, I think we checked that last time we were here. Anyways, um, thanks for your help. Uh, you know what? I don't know. I don't think I'm getting experience for your kills. So maybe you should leave. Or we can see who's better at killing these things. Eddie or... What should we call her? Nancy. 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 Nancy Ranger. Nancy Ranger. Okay. Ours a mole rat. Let's see what the arc is on these things. Okay. Um, not sure where that went. You like that? Yeah. Whoa! Whoa! That's wow. a pretty straight arc, actually. You got nine experience for that. Yeah, it did. Okay, these are definitely different, because you pull the trigger and then you have to wait for the quote-unquote firing to go off, and you got to keep your uh, aim on whatever you're trying to kill. Oh. Sorry, oh. Nancy, not you. Oh. <laughs> So you have time for some last minute adjustments. Just do not over adjust. Yeah, that's one way to think of it. That being said, if they're moving, it's going to be annoying. Uh oh. Uh -oh. That was my oh. phone. Oh. What does my phone have to say? It has to say, hey, are you trying to play whoa, this app? Whoa. Careful. Oh, actually, no. no, they do have a decent drop off. It's hard to tell at night. Yeah. Yeah. Almost hit it. Hey, it counted. I did hit it. I hit it. Or I hit it once at least. I got experience. Okay. Now, what happens when I go like this? Nancy, you're going to want to watch out. Eddie. Eddie. Yeah, whatever. Keep Nancy busy. Are you the throwing spear fist? Maybe. I don't know if that's coming down. Yeah. <laughs> And in other news, <laughs> a new strange object showed up in orbit. In other today. news, the Americans have started the space program. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, um, remember a while back when we were discussing how to do uppercuts? Yes! Uh, so I looked it up. Ooh! It turns out that, yeah, it is. You have to uh, crouch and hit them. Oh. Um, <clears throat> but... Uh, but it's only if you are, ha! only if you're doing um, like a power attack, or something Hurrah! like that, and you're unarmed is up to a certain. Right. I mean, if I can do it in bats as an option, you'd think my unarmed would be at the correct level for it. You think, and maybe it is. All right. Let's uh, let's bumper and. That does look like an uppercut. Yeah. This doesn't look like it from uh, the first person point of view. All right. Cool, cool, cool. You want to see my new thing? My cool thing? Okay. No, no, no. I won't take the fister the, to that <laughs> level. Um, hmm. 
it's nighttime. There probably isn't much. I wonder if they have any vacancy. Hmm. 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 Hot desk. Hello? Hello? Okay, there should be a bell or something I can press. Ding, ding, ding. Hello? Oh, look at all the... Look at all the dinky the dinosaur T-Rexes. <laughs> There's only one in the shop. <laughs> On display. There were a thousand others. <laughs> yeah. Vending machine is free, though. Wow. Yeah, so I'll help myself then. You I? should clearly take all the dinosaurs. Because it's oh, not yeah, like they're so. selling any. Uh, oh. Peas? Ooh, there actually might be vacancies. Peas. Yeah, or nice. just rooms that aren't really fit for habitation. Yeah, uh, yeah that's possible. Yep, it looks like a lot of these keys are uh, integral to the uh, structure of this little key cubby thing. Yeah, they and cannot be interacted with whatsoever. Covers just aren't the same as they used to make them. Yeah. Uh, I'll turn off the radio because I almost got a uh, uh, not a citation, but uh, when I was uploading one of the videos. It was just like, oh, by the way, there's copyright infringement. And it was, uh, Ain't That a Kick in the Head was playing on the radio. Like, six seconds. Oh, God. Yeah. Yeah. But they don't pick up on it when you just kind of hum a few bars and pop song. Tell me quick. Oh, ain't that a kick in the head. And I guess we'll see if the oh, AI yeah. picks up on that. Really, this is Bill all perfect. Of sale. Yeah. Uh, that's tied to a quest, as I recall. Yeah, well, scrap metal might be useful. Um, yeah, I got. It. I can hold off. Let's get this bill of sale, though. I mean, it's her. F it's uh, the proprietor's fault for, uh, you know, not being here to supervise. Okay, Mahai Express drop box. Well, I can ship stuff to Prim. Ooh, hooray! You should ship Eddie. So it's totally fit in Dropbox. I would like to see that. I would like to see me trying to cram Eddie down there. <laughs> Get in there. Oh, your antenna poked me. Get you know in what? there. You know what? You can tell your companions to just, you know, go away or something, right? <laughs> so what if that's what you're doing? You're just shoving your companion in the nearest box and sending him somewhere. <laughs> All right, then. I'll tell you what. We're going to sit right here and wait and get increasingly angry as the proprietor hey, doesn't show up. Desk? Where's the proprietor? Ah, where are you? Oh, now you show up and you walk right by me. Oh my <laughs> god, lady. I swore I wouldn't Nancy. do this to, well, Nancy. But, oh, Nancy's gone. Well, all right. Huh. Well, welcome to you. You look tired from the road. Uh, and waiting. Why don't you relax a spell? Let this fine town take care of you. Um, uh, I don't think we've met yet. Oh, what am I doing? I got to thinking about making a good impression and plain forgot to tell you my name. I'm Jeannie May. I take care of folks here at the motel, long as they aren't troublemakers. I might be a troublemaker, that's, uh, I'm not gonna say, um, yeah, what is this place? It's a town, obviously, but... We're in a little desert oasis, name of Novak. This is the Dino Delight Motel, and it's mine. Oh, nice place you got here. Sounds delightful. Yeah, Dino Delight. <laughs> we are so witty. <laughs> uh, what is there of interest around here? Well, there's Dinky, the town mascot. He's a sight. Hmm. You probably already saw him when you came in, but you can go up inside, too. Up the roadways to the west, there's Repcon. That's the old rocket factory. Rocket factory? There's been oh, some sinister aliens. characters out there lately, <laughs> yeah. so you may want to stay clear. Other than that, nothing to do Smells but like take it easy and enjoy good company. Anything else? Well, up north a ways, you'll see a big tower. That's Helios 1. Used to be a power plant in its day. And there's a town just east of here called Nelson. Used to be such a quaint little place until those slavers took it over. 
But we got our wonderful snipers keeping an eye in that direction, and so far, the slavers have left us alone. You've got snipers, do you? I could use a sniper rifle. Okay, well, it looks like we got a few things. What's the quickest way out of this stuff? <laughs> um, Repcon sounds interesting, but I'm more interested in this town for now. Where could I get some supplies if I wanted? Go see Cliff Briscoe at the Dino Bike gift shop oh, right. and tell him I sent you. Forgot he kind of. I think he gets lonely yeah. standing around in that dino belly all day. He'll be glad for the company. Poor soul. Uh, um, not that I actually care, but why don't you tell me if you've seen anybody in a checkered coat? Um, just random, I don't know, census survey. Men in checkered coats are a, uh, are a dwindling part of our population, and it's very oh, important. important. It's very dwindling commodity. A dwindling commodity. No, dwindling part of our com of our of our demographic culture, people, and we need to track their migration. <laughs> well, he might have been wearing a fancy outfit, but he wasn't any kind of gentleman to me. Mm. Had his nose Drug stuck so him. high in the air you couldn't see it above the clouds. City folk. They always think they deserve better than what they got. Those hoodlums he was with seem to know Manny for some reason. He's our daytime sniper up in the dinosaur's mouth. Interesting. But there's a sniper in the dinosaur's mouth. Yes, daytime snipers. That implies a nighttime sniper as well. Okay, interesting. Uh, what has been going on in town lately? Well, let's see. Dusty McBride's been losing some Brahmin, but that's probably the heat more than anything. I think they've been killing each Honestly, other, actually. If that's the it's guy, been I think. real quiet. Ranger Andy's still hurt, but we got these two gentlemen snipers watching the road day and night, keeping the trash out of Novak. They've been a blessing. You know, I like the term gentleman sniper. <laughs> <laughs> I think I have a new idea for a character for tabletop RPG. Ah. Uh. International man of sharpshooting. Mm hmm. Oops. Goodbye. Watch out for strangers. Mm. Don't need to rent a room just yet. Your couch was just fine. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, the dinosaur is also facing towards the slavers. Yes, well, we know that the legionary, the legion are slavers. And uh, the Legion does come out of the east, so um, yes, this tracks. Uh, daytime sniper, let's see. Do, 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 do. Keep it tight, Victor. Howdy, partner. Da, 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 da. Oh, Manny. What's going on, man? Who are <laughs> Manny. <you? laughs> uh, who are you? I'm Manny. I'm on security detail here. You see a rifle barrel sticking out of the dinosaur's mouth, you got a 50-50 shot at me. Otherwise, it's boom. So flip a coin? No. Um, yeah, uh, I hear about slavers and whatnot, but I imagine every once in a while, scorpions probably wander a bit too close, or maybe death claws? You name it. Anything that comes within a thousand yards that looks like trouble. Oh, you missed me. Lately, we've been getting <laughs> ghouls, coming from the road to Repcon out to the west. Quite a few last couple days. The big threat is the Legion coming from the east. If they decide to attack with a full force, they'll run us over. But so far, we've been lucky. So, Repcon must be full of all sorts of radiation. Possibly, yeah. If, um, a bunch of ghouls, right? Yeah. Hmm. I mean, ghouls like radiation, but they don't strictly need it. No, um, yeah, Boone? Boone's a sniper, same as me. Used to spot for him when we were enlisted with the NCR. After we got out, I talked him into settling down here. So, here we are. I'd introduce you, but uh, we're not so friendly right now. Well, you hardly see each other, so um, it sounds like a great way for friendship, right? You ever hear stories about... Uh... <coughs> well, then. <laughs> Sorry. Hopefully it wasn't picked up on my mic. Uh, did you ever hear uh, stories about ma married couples who uh, would work different shifts... And then they'd go on vacation and realize they can't stand being with each other all the time. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, so yeah, you were in the NCR and uh, 
You're proficient as a sniper, though apparently you were also a spotter. Oh, it was great. I wouldn't trade really? it. Really? Something about that lifestyle, the discipline, seeing new places, making people safe. What's not to like? Yeah, when you put it that way. But, um, what about idiot bureaucracy? Uh, well, I just felt like it was time, you know? Wanted to have a home. Plus, I was up at Camp Golf when Bitter Springs went down. I faked like I was sick to get out of going because I knew some of the people there. But when everybody came back, nobody would tell me what happened, and people would call us murderers sometimes when we showed up to secure towns. Bitter Springs. Um, it's been a while, but I think that's a con place, I right? I still don't know exactly. Just that a tribals? lot of people died who didn't want to be a part of the fighting at all. Ooh. I don't blame anybody for it. There's so much chaos when you're fighting. You're lucky not to shoot your own guys. But it did take something out of it for me. It just wasn't the same. So when it came time to re-enlist, I just took my papers and walked. But then you got, you know, caught by the stop-loss program and, uh... They extended you for like another 30 years and then they just kept you doing tours upon yeah. tours upon tours in a desert that you don't actually care for. Um, maybe I'm thinking of a different thing. Um, hmm. Yeah, so, okay, I think Bitter Springs was um, Khans, which they're, uh, uh, they're uh, like a tribe, not really like raiders or anything necessarily. Like they're not hostile to absolutely everyone. But uh, if that's the case, then two of the people that were with um, Chandler were cons. And uh, so if he knew them, and he knows the people that were at Bitter Springs... Okay, so yeah, that's how he knows the people that were with Chandler. Okay. What does Chandler Bing have to do with this game? Uh, he apparently likes to run around in checkered coats, trying to bolster the checkered coat population. Chandler, Chandler Bing? Bing? Chandler Bing! <laughs> Actually, it's Miss Chenandler Bong. <laughs> <laughs> okay, a man in a checkered coat. Sure, I know him. What do you want with him? Um, honestly? Uh... He took my delivery. Honestly, I'm trying, I'm looking for the answer as to why I want to look for him. But for some reason, the game keeps on insisting that I ask about him. So answers. Must be something pretty important to be chasing a guy like that. Eh. Well, listen, I, I can know. definitely help you find him, but I've got problems of my own. Oh, well, it's not pressing. Maybe we can do a trade. You need my help. There's something I need, too. Oh, good. We get a quest. What Hooray. kind of thing? Um, do you need a javelin thrown into space? I, I can I'm, do that. I'm very good at that. I can really do that well. Novak, it's home for me now. I want that to be for good. I like it here, and I've left too many homes behind. But the only resource we got here is junk. Without that, people wouldn't have anything to trade. They'd all have to leave. We get most of it up the road from the old rocket test site, but a bunch of ghouls showed up one day and took it over. We can't get in there now. Interesting. Um, uh, yeah, I imagine... You're either sleeping or you're sitting in the dinosaur, so that's probably why you don't. What exactly needs to be done? Well, they gotta go, or this will be a ghost town before long. Doesn't matter to me what you do. As long as the ghouls are out of there, that's good enough for me. Oh, you gotta go ghoul hunting. I, yeah, I mean... Not horrible. I punched a few ghouls. I seem to gain karma from it, so... Let's see what can be done. It'd mean a lot to me. I'm pretty sure the ghouls like being punched. Yeah. Come fly with me, let's fly away. Uh, what was I supposed to do again? No, why are you on bad terms with Boone? You mentioned he's, uh, you're not friendly right now. Me and his wife, we didn't see eye to eye on some things. We had some pretty big arguments. Okay. One day, she turns up missing, and he hasn't said a word to me since. Okay. Um... Like, what would cause such big arguments? Or do you got something? Uh, I was wondering, does Boone think that Annie took out his wife? That's possible. I mean, see why he's told to him. Leia, what, what, what were these arguments exactly? Man, you name it. Oh. See, I grew up in North Vegas. Me and my cousins. We were some bad seeds. Got in with a gang. I loved it. Then something happened, and I couldn't handle it anymore. 
So I enlisted, earned my future, brought down my best friend to share that future with me. And here was this woman, who was too good for it, trying to take him away. So yeah, I didn't see eye to eye with the bitch. Ah, so you're in love with Boom. Ah. Uh, I gotcha. I get it. Yep, yep, I understand. You had to go behind your back and marry to someone else. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's terrible.